Hello everybody, this is Brisbane05 Blast here and welcome back to another video of this channel. Today, I'm actually going to show you one of the interesting matches that we've actually going to see and it's not from FIFA 14, 18 or 22. It is from the nostalgic times that many of you will enjoy. I'm just going to tell you the teams though. It's Chelsea versus Man United on the FIFA 2 gameplay. Yeah, that's right, FIFA 2002 on the PS1, PlayStation 1. You may be wondering how I have PlayStation. Yeah, I actually do have PlayStation, but that may it may not be like physically. It's not physically here. I have it on the website called Retro Game CC. You should have that. I mean, I'm just going to tell you the website so you may so it's for people who do not have PlayStation or any other consoles. That is for you. Go to Retro Game CC, then you'll see one of your favorite games there. You'll enjoy. You'll have that experience. But we're not going to talk about this. We're going to talk about the games. We're going to talk about those two teams. So as you can see, as we, as you saw in my previous video, Chelsea were pretty good. But at the penalty shootout, they went too weak. They were weak at this stage and Milan were dominant. And yeah, Chelsea were not that strong though. However, Man United on the other hand, they have won against PSG but lost in the Manchester Derby against City on penalties. And they're up against Chelsea too. They're actually they're actually gonna verse Chelsea. And you know both these teams are actually having good good attack and good defense. And good midfield attack too. So also just to let you know that this game does not actually have audio because it's actually running at the wrong frame. So I decided to mute it and actually put myself do the commentary in that video. So so I replaced my commentary which you know the other commentator with me instead. So, you know, just to make it interesting. And yeah. So I really hope you enjoy this match as this game will be taking place at Stamford Bridge yet again. And hopefully this game should be interesting and hopefully can go down to the wire. So yeah. I hope you like this. Make sure you subscribe and hit the like button because nobody has done that. So yeah. Let's head to the stadium where you can enjoy the game and enjoy the nostalgic appearance. Alright guys, so... Here are the teams here that are actually going to be playing this game. Chelsea versus Man United, Manchester United. I was actually going to look for Manchester City there, but unfortunately City is not there in, in any of these three FIFAs. But he's only there in FIFA 2003. So, But I actually picked this gameplay because I wanted to have good experience here. And it also has a good team logos as well. So yeah. But as you can see, both these teams are actually feeling good even-sided. Look at that. The attack is like 5 out of 6 and defense is 4 out of 6. But Man United is like 100% as you can see right here. So yeah. So let's see who's going to win this game. Is it going to be Chelsea or Man United? I'm going to keep things simulated. And yeah. So yeah, we'll be right back for the match. Just need to wait for this loading to end. Alright, we're back here. And look at the sides. Look at the starting 11 for Chelsea and Man United. These teams look pretty even-sided here. And yeah, hopefully this game should be interesting here. So Hasselbank starts the kickoff for Chelsea. Lampard has the ball. So just to let you know, this is actually on my PC and not on PlayStation. Because you may wonder why I have this game, because this is from PC. And that is a good, good, good start for Chelsea as they win a free kick. Let's see what Chelsea can do here. Hasselbank starts the free kick, but a good defense from Man United here. So, Chelsea is desperate for a win here because they had a loss against AC Milan in my previous video. As you saw that, it all came to penalties and AC Milan were victorious. Chelsea were pretty bad at penalties. And, yeah, that's why they didn't get a win for this video. Whereas Man United, on the other hand, they had a win in the... They had a win in this video. Like, I mean, they had a win in... Like, they only had one win. They had a win against PSG, but lost to Man City. And as you can see, Chelsea players started to get a good shot, but what a defense from Bathis. And here's Giggs, Ryan Giggs. Passed it to Zola, who intercepted it. Pettit has the ball. Passed it to Di Matteo. Now, hopefully Di Matteo has a chance here. He needs to think. But Brown takes it safely. Passes it to Giggs, then to Veron. Pass it to Van Histerui. 
Nistel Rue, is it? Yeah, Nistel Rue, not Histel Rue, right? Then he passed it to Schultz, but Dasaili with a good tackle here. What a good tackle from Dasaili. Now he passed it to Zola. Then Zola passed it to Zenden. And now he has to pass to Dasaili. So the player to watch here to me is David Beckham here because David Beckham is a good striker for Man United, if you know what I mean. Everyone loves David Beckham. Well, every Man United fans love David Beckham. Not all of them, but yeah. He's a good player for Man United, so he's the player to watch. Because David Beckham has a stellar finish here. Now, Man United have a chance. Can he score? But Bosnich with a save. Mark Bosnich with a good save for Chelsea, preventing the goal for Man United. And Hasselbank with a good recovery here. Passes it to Lampard, then to Hasselbank. Hasselbank tried to go for a long-range shot, but Barthes easily saves it. What a good save from Barthes. And, yeah. Now, Man United has a chance to attack. They're having opportunities. But Malkia with a good save. Pass it to Hasselbank, then to Zenden. Zenden needs to think carefully here. Zola with a good recovery pass. But what a save from Barthes. And it's a corner kick for Chelsea. And Barthes, look at the saves for them. For him, he has three saves. That is good for Barthes, and good for Man United also. So Chelsea has won a corner. Let's see what Di Matteo can do here. That was not a good corner, and it's safely prevented. As now Man United has a chance to score here. Well, they have a chance to counter attack after this wasted opportunity from Chelsea, but a good interception. And we see an offside player, and that's Zenden. He's offside for Chelsea. And now Man United have an opportunity here. Van Nistel Rui have an opportunity. What a skill, but Bosnich with a good save. That's a good save from Bosnich. And he gets a good kick that he passes to Zola, then to Di Matteo. And what a skill from Di Matteo there, but nah. But he still has the ball, though. Zola has the ball for Chelsea. But I think he... He might have overdone it too quickly. That pass was too deep for him. That's why he didn't get it. And now Di Matteo has the ball. Can he do the... Ah, uh, of course. That was a worse kick from Di Matteo. Barthes with a brilliant save. And we go into stoppage time. And it's half time already. As you can see, both these teams, they're literally even-sided, man. Look at that. So yeah, these teams look even-sided. As you can see, we're just going to see the score here. And look at the shots, total shots for Chelsea. They dominated. Man United only has two shots on target and two shots, of course. So I'm just going to make changes here. So we'll be right back. Hi guys, we're back. So just need to make some changes. I already made changes here. Just need to bring back to simulation mode. And as you can see, it all looks same. There's nothing to separate. So we're just going to start the second half. And look at the practice. Look at the practice behind the scenes here. Chelsea trying to practice here. Man United practicing with a free kick. That's all the practice they have. So as you can see, look at the substitutions we've made. So as you can see, Gallus has gone for Chelsea and John Terry comes in. And Van Nistelrooy goes off for Man United and Solskjaer comes in. And Solskjaer, what a good start for him. And what a good goal from him. That is a good substitution Man United has made. Because Solskjaer has his first touch of the ball. And he scored the goal at the start of the second half. That is brilliant. Brilliant stuff from Man United. But we're going to see if Chelsea can fight back. Because this is far from over. And yep, Man United has the ball now. But Zola with a good interception. And that was not a good kick. That is a brilliant... But, but really, that was a brilliant goal from Sosha. That was a good substitution though. From Man United bench. And that is a bad place to lose. To lose the ball here. As it's a free kick concede from Chelsea. And now Man United has a chance to make it 2-0. Possibly, who knows. But Bosnich with a save. 
Bosnich has to keep his players active because this might be his last. Who knows? Well, his last to have an opportunity, what that means, yeah. The Saley though. Zenden with the ball. What a pass, but that was a that was terrible. That was pretty terrible. And now Veron has the ball. As you can see, Man United trying to keep themselves active here. Bosnich with a save. And Chelsea with a good recovery. Hasselbank, perfect opportunity here. Zola with the ball. What can he do? No, what a, that's a good tackle from Neville. What a tackle from Neville here. Time is ticking away though. Chelsea has to think fast and smart because anything can happen here. Anything can really happen. Zenden has the ball. Zenden, that was not a good kick here. Why did you have to waste your opportunities here? Barthes with a what an easy save though. But Sasha, he should be the man of the match here because that was a good substitution that they've made. Babiora with the ball. Chelsea has to think smart here because this is almost going to end here. 16 added min 16 minutes to finish. Look at Chelsea doing. They're not even they're not even surging in. They're just kicking from long range. That is literally wasted. Veron with a good ball. Giggs. Bosnich again. This is end to end here. Six saves from Bosnich. Zola with a ball. Passes it to Frankie Lampard. Lampard has to think smart. Hasselbank with a good pass. And what a goal from Zola. That is what Chelsea needed. That is what Chelsea needed. That is a good goal from here. What a good pass from Hasselbank though. His goal assist. And what a goal from Zola. What a goal. And as we are, as we see, the game is locked with one all the score line with six more minutes to go each sides need to look for for a match winning goal which team will provide can this be a comeback here for Chelsea because Man United drew their first blood Hasselbeck with a good shot but a save from Barthes oh my goodness this is final chance for Chelsea here Barthes he's the man to watch here with final minutes left, Chelsea has to think smart, but a good save. That is so... And now they can just time waste. Or maybe Man United has their last attack. Beckham with a good pass. But what a good save. And it's ended as the end of 90 minutes. We're going to go to golden point here. That was a good start though, man. We'll be back for golden point here. We're not going to end the game as a draw. Golden goal it is. Alright, so we are at golden goal. Each side's looking for the their last win, their last goal. But which team will provide? Will it be Chelsea or Man United? All right, moments of silence here. Moments of silence. Jeez. All right. They have the good pass. Sasha with the ball. What can you think here? But nah, that was not a good place to do it. Terry with the ball. Passes it to one of those best players here. Now they have to think. And yeah. That's. Bosnich is too good here. He is too good. He's also the Aussie goalkeeper if you know what I mean. Zola with the ball. Passes it to Frankie Lampard. He should have actually skilled the player. What was he thinking? What was he thinking man? 103 minutes. We're already almost... For the second second half of golden goal. But wait. Sasha. Sasha with the golden goal. 
What a game! Seriously, what a game that is! He has won the game for Man United. This is by far the best game we've ever seen. What a win from Sosha and what a winning goal from Sosha, which actually means Man United are today's winner. This is by far the best game we've ever seen. Oh my goodness, but not as best as Chelsea versus AC Milan though, unfortunately. But this is like the best goal. A, a match-winning goal from Sosha actually won the game for Man United. As you can see, the shots. Eight shots on target for Chelsea. They were dominant at the first half. But then a, then a goal conceded from Chelsea. Sosha scored the opening goal for, in the second half. And then Zola equalizing it. Making it one all, and then this man, Sasha, he made it 2 1, and it made it too easy. It all came at the 104th minute. What a game! Sorry, Chelsea. I know you tried your best, but this game goes to Man United. They were too strong. Alright, so that's it for today's episode. Or today's gameplay hope you guys enjoy this and we will be back for another fifa gameplays goodbye hello guys we're back and just as you actually witness this game was pretty crazy and i mean it was pretty crazy you have to see that game it went down to the wire those two teams manchester united and chelsea that finish from Oli gunner sosha was pretty fantastic the norwegian man Oli gunner sosha he scored the brilliant goal at the top left corner to win the game for Manchester United. And it was not pretty easy. So, I'll tell you the story. So, as you saw, Chelsea were pretty dominant at the first half of the game. They had four shots on target, while Manchester United had only two shots on target. But then, the second half came. Ole Gunnar Sosha, the man who scored the opening goal of the second half, and thought that Manchester United are coming home. But then Zola, Zola scored the goal thanks to Hasselbank's goal assist, which put it into, he scored, which helped Zola score the equalizer goal. And it went down to the wire. It was so close until this man, this man who was a threat to Chelsea and a savior to Manchester United. Yeah, that's right. Oli Gunnar Sosha, he scored the match winning goal at 104th minute at the top left corner, which gave the Manchester United the victory that they deserve. And yeah, I really like this game. Too bad there was no audio because the reason for this is because it is running in the wrong frame. And just to actually let you know this, so 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 I have to like mute it and decide to add my commentary in it just to make it interesting. And yeah, it went well and fantastic. So yeah, Manchester United got the win. And that's all we have for today. So, hope you guys enjoy this. Please make sure to subscribe to my channel. It means a lot to me, man. I'm glad that my subscriber channels are increasing. My subscribers and my views are increasing. But it has to be at 30 subscribers at the end of this month. I'm not asking 50 subscribers. At least 30. Please. If you must. Anyway, hope you really enjoy this. So, I'll be uploading more FIFA gameplays. This is Brisbane05Blaster here. Signing off.